All right. A wise man once said, you can create the greatest system of all time. You can build the most complicated programs. You can design the best and brightest company and put all the pieces in place to get massive profits or do very well in life or help people in ministry. I was mainly talking about ministry at the time, but we're going to apply it to all things in life. You can do all of that and have everything in line and it will run 100% right, except when you put humans in it. And you know what I realized? I realized that that, that, that didn't make any sense at the time because inherently I believe that humans have a morality and, and they, they won't they won't jack the system up. Like if you created a ministry to literally help people in a way that they felt right, they knew they were doing right, and morally they were giving to people, then then oh my goodness, how could the system fail? And then I realized, then I realized later in life, and especially with Bitcoin, how jacked up humans are. So first off, I don't believe Bitcoin was created by AI. Why? Because of how, I don't swear, but messed up it is right now. Insert word. Like seriously, it is a complete disaster right now. Like the whole, this, this whole system is jacked. Okay, we've got manipulation of hash rate. We got manipulation of markets. We got big whales doing who knows what they want to the system. We've got people stealing thieves, right? We've got wallets being hacked. We've got exchanges being hacked. We've got we've got um, companies being destroyed and backhand deals, and they're connected to exchanges and they're doing this and that, and then we're getting attacks and like <sighs> seriously. Somebody says I have 10 times their speed. Like, this is the frustrating part that I realized of the fast five years of Bitcoin. And, 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 and if you guys watched um, my, 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 my most recent, I think it was my most recent video, where I, I was talking, I, I was just literally driving in, in, a, in a car. And I was just like, oh, man, this, this, is, this, is, this is just sad. Let me let me show you right about right about here, you know it it this is where I realized like I was this was a ten hour drive and I filmed this scene because it hit me like right about here it hit me how screwed up Bitcoin is because of humans. No seriously seriously, Bitcoin is remarkable. Blockchain is incredible. It's life changing. It's worldwide humanity ever breaking all the barriers of everything. And it sucks. It's awful. It's manipulated. It's a disaster. In fact, if I knew any better, I would hate it. If I wasn't so passionate about Bitcoin, I would despise it. I would despise blockchain technology because of how many lives it's screwed up. Because of how many companies it's destroyed. Because of how much power it's wasted over uh, lost coin, right? Like, I mean, the beauty of blockchain is there. And yet, somehow, we allowed humans to screw it up. We screwed it up. How do we do this? How do we do this? How, how, how? And it just, uh, just, uh, just, I get so angry thinking that, we had the perfect system and and we we jacked it up all we jacked it up kyler is in the chat he said glad i made it safe thank you thank you thank you thank you for joining us kyler you're awesome he helped us out a lot holy smokers we're gonna have to take a minute break because we got it all the super chat oh my goodness keep up the good work thank you mad balls and feeders i don't know what that's from I hope it's not crass, but thank you. Seriously. <laughs> um, Emma, Emma Slinger says dot. Emma Slinger says what? Did I miss something from Emma Slinger or something here? Like, I don't really know. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Even every investor into Bitcoin wanted to cash out. How much money could they get? In other words, what is the value of all of Bitcoin? 
Okay, so now we're going to have a chat about that. That's not my point. But guys, my point is humans screwed it up. And if I could, if I swore, that's where I would put the word. Humans, insert word, messed it up. Right? Like, really. Blockchain technology would be way different if it wasn't for humans messing it up. Okay? And I don't know if it was greed. I don't know if it was selfishness. I don't know if it was just idiots, like moron developers. I don't know what it was, but whatever it was, like that's what really screwed up Bitcoin and blockchain, okay? It, it, it wasn't whales uh, that manipulated the markets, right? It wasn't like, oh, that's a bad code or, oh, let's fork the coin or, Oh, let's change the hash rate power or, oh, let's inflate the price to absurd amounts and then, oh, let's dump it down. Like, no, 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 no. It was humans. Let's just, let's just call it for what it is. It was screwed up humans. Okay. And I, I'm just as screwed up, right? Okay. Like I'm just as, as sinfully and wrong as a terrible person and just as can be. Okay. So let's get that out there. But that's the reason it's screwed up. And so, you know what I realized? I want to be a part of something and and I'm going out there and just saying it because this is outrageous and I'm just blurting it out because there's no way that I know anybody in this field at all. You know what I want? I want an, a 100% beyond AI system running blockchain. I want the AI raw computer of CPU, GPU, ASIC, and every other FPGA crapola that we can think of in our brains and develop in hardware. And I want that layer of software to be AI. I don't want us to touch it. I don't want us to think about it. I don't want us to tell it what it should be. I don't want us to program it. I don't want any human, any involvement at all on the software side of anything related to blockchain. I want hardware to be made by humans. Screw it. I don't even want that. I want the hardware to be maintained and run and logically make sense to humans. Robots can build the hardware, for goodness sakes, because they're going to do it better. And then I want humans to just step aside and look at the pure beauty of what blockchain can be. And it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen when humans are writing the code. That's my belief. The internet works and it's beautiful because of how diversified it is. Let's be real. The internet is way more diversified than blockchain is. Okay. And it works because you have a collaboration of a lot of humans doing a lot of different things at a lot of, at a lot of different times. And over the course of the last 30 years, it's created this Mecca of all things incredible. And, 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 and until I don't think blockchain can ever be that because there's money involved. Now, now there's the internet and then people get paid off the internet, right? You get a job. I get, I got, I make money off online. I make money online. Yeah, I make money on my internet. I make money on the internet, right? Like, no, no, no. The internet doesn't pay you. Okay. But in blockchain, the blockchain pays you. So like we can't be involved in it because I mean, like, like the good book says the love, the love of money, the love of money is the root of all evil. And so that's probably what happened. That's probably what it was. It was probably the screwed up love of money that created the complete disaster of Bitcoin was. And, I, 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 and I'm sorry it took me five years to realize this. It really did. I have such passion and hope about blockchain that I did not want to, to admit the denial that uh, it's screwed up. It's messed up. And if I hadn't spent the last five years involved in it, I would hate it. I would absolutely passionately hate blockchain technology. I would. So yeah, man, I'm just saying, you don't need humans to code AI. Look at the game of Go, Emma Singer says. Uh, I, I, you don't need humans to code AI, okay? AI can code itself. AI can code AI, okay? And that is who needs to run blockchain. I want to build hardware. Okay, I love hardware, right, guys? I love mining. I built facilities. I built, I tore them down. I had clients. I lost them, right? I love hardware, okay? But, you know, software gets really screwed up. People steal stuff. And it's really hard to steal. 
let's be real. It's really hard to steal ASICs. I mean, yeah, somebody walked away with like, what, it was 50, 50 ASICs or something, or 5,000 ASICs or something. It's hard to do. That is hard to do. Okay. You want to jack up an exchange? That's not hard to do. That's really not. You can do it right here. I can do it right here. I could do it right here from this room. I could jack up and steal millions of Bitcoins. I don't even have to leave my seat. But when AI runs it, you don't have a chance. You don't have a chance. Because you think like a human and you screw it up. And the love of the money is the root of all evil. And that's what it is. We got nothing but evil in, in blockchain now. It's all screwed up. It's all screwed up. Okay. That's my, that's my chant. I'm going to make that into a separate video. So if you guys missed it, ding, I'm going to cut that off right here. Thank you. All right, guys. What if I missed the chat? The blockchain doesn't pay you. The blockchain creates some tokens. It's a lottery. No, the blockchain can literally pay you. You can literally get the blockchain to pay you. You can write code so the blockchain pays you. Yes, you can. You can have a wallet set up on the blockchain. The blockchain says if this code is completed, pays you in coin. So, yeah. Anyways. Man. All right, so Emma saying is, do you know anything about AI? I do, and I can tell you they do not spawn their own. Yet, look at the game of Go. That's 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 freaky. That's freaky amazing. Look at the game of Go, Emma. Emmanuel? <laughs> His name is Emmanuel. I keep calling him Emma. Can I call you Emma, please? Every time you're on the stream. Every time. Can I please call Emma? Guys, what the heck are you doing right now? Please hit that button. Just just hit the button. It's really not that hard. Just hit the button. Please hit the button. Please hit the button. 10% of you are subscribed right now. And go over here and hit vote, okay? Because, like, come on. Just, just hit vote. I mean, I would really like that. You guys are, like, legit. And I appreciate that. All right. False... Fallacy warning. No, no, no. Emmanuel, let's, let's, we're going to chat about this more. Stay tuned on the channel. This is literally the infancy of a thought that I had running down the road, okay, in, 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 in a 10 hour drive, closing my company. I mean, do you, do you realize how upset I was here? Like, I literally am driving away from a, a, a half a million dollar organization that I created, okay, and I'm driving away. Just leaving, leaving all of it. I'm on the road, leaving it all goodbye. Okay, I had a lot of time to think, yo. I had a lot of time to think, okay? Uh, my wife was driving behind me, okay? I had nobody to talk to. I didn't get on calls for hours at a time. I just sat there and thought, and it hurt, and it hurt to think about what Bitcoin was. And, and this is, that's what I realized. That's what I realized. So, yeah. Yeah. <sighs> 